Hey friends, in this video I will show you how we can block the uh, existing applications on any machine through the group policy. So just I logged on my domain controller and I will go on the group policy management console through the GPMC command. And here you can just create a group policy or you can just edit the existing group policy which is linked with uh, any organizational unit where you want to uh, block the application so I am just going to create a new one so I will just uh, click on the new and will assign a name application blocking and you can assign the name accordingly as per your requirement but uh, here I just assigned a name application blocking now I will edit this group policy and will go on the policies and administrative templates and here is the option system inside the administrative templates so we are just blocking this applications on the user basis so just I will click on the system and here in the system when you expand the system so here you can see you you have the multiple group policy configurations related with the various kind of uh, options so here I will select the don't run specified windows applications I will just edit this one and here I will click the enable now in the list of disallowed applications you need to just mention the exe name of your application which you want to block like ms paint.exe and uh, if you want to add more exe so just click on the enter or just select the uh, next text box here you can specify the name like uh, chrome.exe and uh, here you can specify firefox.exe so I'm just blocking these three applications here if you have more uh, suspicious applications in fact so you can mention over here so uh, this will be also blocked sometimes like auditor say, says that to just block this suspicious applications uh, suspicious exe so just you can specify the name of the application over here now I will click on the OK and will click on the apply and OK so this policy has been configured successfully now I will assign this group policy to the um, on, on the OU where user exists so in case if user is working on any laptop uh, with their user accounts windows account so these applications will be blocked so currently I will just assign this group policy on infra ops uh, organizational unit so I will right click on this infra underscore ops organizational unit and will assign the link and existing GPO so I just created the group policy for application blocking is application underscore blocking now I will click on OK and will uh, go on the machine where this user exists or logging so I will close this group policy and I will go on the machine uh, where user exists so first I will check the users which are uh, which are inside the infra underscore ops OU where we have assign this group policy for application blocking so I will go on the user computer snap in through this dsa.msc command and here you can see there are the uh, three users which exist inside the infra underscore ops OU so I will just log in log in, in with with any one of them and we'll see the uh, group policy uh, how it is blocking the application on these three these three users because one of them is just disabled so I am talking about these three users now I just came on the machine where this user is just log, logged on so I will go on the CMD and we will see the user property which user is accessing this machine CMD who am I this is a command which you can use to check the currently logged on users on any machine so this is my domain and in ENG one is the user 
now I will just try to access the Google Chrome uh, before before uh, checking the Google Chrome or any applications which is blocked so you need to just run the GP update command to check the um, group policy uh, uh, which will be applied on this machine and uh, GP update force or you need to wait for the next group policy update otherwise you can just execute the GP update or GP update force this will uh, take the group policy effectively uh, within a, a minute now I will go on the RSOP this command will use to generate the group policy which is applying on this machine this is in progress I will go on the computer configuration so this policy is not related with the computer configuration so we'll go on the user configuration so now you can see the application underscore blocking group policy is applied and even you can also see the settings which we have applied for the user configuration so here this group policy is applied and you can cross check the applications which are blocked over here chrome firefox ms paint so I will just check with any one of them or you can also check with other applications which you have blocked on your machine through the group policy. So this uh, currently Google Chrome and Firefox is just uh, installed on this machine. So I will click on this. So now you can see this operation has uh, cancelled due to restriction in effect on this computer. Please contact your system administrator. So if you have blocked any applications on uh, on the any specific user through the group policy so you will get this notification this is the restriction message which you will see on the machine where group policy has been applied for blocking the applications uh, thank you for watching this video in the next video we will see some other group policy settings uh, and uh, some other uh, group policy configurations which will help you to uh, control the user machines or system uh, in your infrastructure.